Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to yet another episode of... There was something on my finger. <laughs> Today we have a loaded, loaded episode with... Quite a bit of just things. They're awesome. Um, let's just go ahead and get right into it. Screw it. <laughs> First out, the real... Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets, Secrets for the original Xbox on the Platinum Hits. Um, complete. As I try to make them as usual. Got to make that lined up. It probably won't get to the person who bought it, bought it in that, can, that way. It'll probably be spun around upside down or something. But uh, fantastic, fantastic game. Good pickup. Great price. Great, great price. So great find for whoever got this. Gonna adjust this just a hair. Oh, oh, yep. Yeah. Oh, oh. Yeah. Wow. Okay. And then, this is probably the most random thing I have had in my store, but it was brand new, sealed up. Uh, I, there's nothing else I can really say about it. Bodily fluid cleanup kit. <laughs> so, it's it's great for um cleaning up bodily fluids and uh yeah i i just i found this and i could not help but pick it up i'm happy it's sold it's 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 cool it's different and i know somebody would need it so i, I a great great price i know i got rid of this for a good price too but <laughs> One of the most oddball things I've ever had in my store. It is cool to finally see it go out. It's been been in my store for quite a while, but I knew it was one of those things that it would be the right person that needed it at the right time. So I'm glad it could go. Somebody needs it. Then we got quite a few cards going out today. Uh, first one is a Yu-Gi-Oh! Chaos Nephthys. Nephthys. I don't know. It's time to do 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 It's a really, really cool card. There's a hair. Um, super clean. Really good looking. Uh, I love those hollows on Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Great, great card. Don't know much about them, but still a good card. Next up, I've sold this exact card before, and it sold very fast, just like this one sold very, very fast. Uh, Justin Jefferson, rookie card, and it's the portraits. Um, once again, this guy is a heck of a ball player. God, <laughs> if he keeps it up the way he's going, he's going to be a future Hall of Famer, but great card, great pickup for ever got this, and I know I'm getting, ri good, getting rid of it for a great price, so if somebody wants to send it off to get graded, more power to you. I've said in a previous episode, I wish I could afford to do it. Because I would have a lot of cards getting sent out. And then we got two cards that are very similar. Uh, they're from the same year. Um, and uh, there's not much else I can say. They're, it's a swatch. So for those of you who don't know what a swatch is, it's basically like it's a game-used jersey. Um, or material worn by the player. This one is for Joel Embiid. Gotta be very, very careful. Because the pl plastic, sometimes I get a little bit of scratch on them. But the card itself, great, 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 great shape. Looks good. Um, I don't, these aren't numbered. So it's not like they're um, a limited run of things. But uh, cool looking card for Joel and B, at least. Uh, I really, really like swatches and game used material and stuff. And the next one that was very similar to this in the same year, Grant Hill. I love the color of the jersey that's on this. Fantastic card. Grant Hill, one of the greatest players I liked watching whenever I was a kid growing up. Um, and this is game worn material too, so really, 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 really cool pickup. I wish I would have kept that. Wish I would have kept it, but someone get more use out of it than I would. So uh, the ne this next one, this person bought two cards, so they're shipping out together. 
Uh, first one in there, um, mini bundle, is a Christian Pash, Pache. I, some of these players' names I don't know. Uh, this one is out of numbered out of 2021. So it's just one of those lines of cards that um, it came out in the year 2021, and it's numbered for 2021. But it is a rookie card for the Atlanta Braves. Really cool card. I like the design on it. Cannot go wrong with that whatsoever. Then, I couldn't, I did not, I ran out of hard plastics for this, so I had to use one of these. I don't like these for shipping stuff because they don't protect very well. At least in my opinion. I mean, it does what it needs to as far as like preserving it, but I'd much rather send something in a hard plastic than this flimsy plastic stuff. But this card is super, super cool. Ronald Acuna Jr. Uh, I like the frame on this. It's a little bit thicker. It's going to be hard to tell in the camera, but uh, super clean little card. I love this. So for the multiple items you purchased, I thank you very much, my good sir or ma'am. Very, very much appreciated. Then we have... I put this up on auction because... This card, somebody better send it off to get shipped. Or get shipped, get get graded. Because I 1,000 trillion billion gazillion percent... Will Somewhere between 700 billion and a trillion 300 million. If I could afford it. And I even put it in this frame because it, it's in such, such good shape. Like I can... If this is not a 10, it's a 9.5. Uh, John Morant slam card and it looks like a magazine cover these are so cool I, should have got it. God, I hate when i do that but um plays from the memphis grizzlies if you do not know who he is watch his boys highlight reels this dude is not human it seems like sometimes but um awesome 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 card <sighs> i'm so jealous seriously um I, there's nothing else I can say. This is just a, such a cool card. Great ball player, good pickup. And then to wrap things up, get these cards out of the way. To wrap things up, I love getting rid of these two because they're so cool. Um, Yukon Denali, uh, licensed car. Uh, they're, they're just a 124 scale, so they're a lot smaller, of course, because I wouldn't be able to pick up a full size car in my hands. But, uh, these replica cars that they're so cool. I, I just, if I had one for the car I own, I absolutely would. The most favorite car I've owned is my Hyundai Tiburon, which was Canadian car. Um, and no, I'm not based on Canada. I'm in the U S but I bought a Canadian based car and it was so freaking cool. It's just, it had no suspension and stuff. So it would beat the crap out of my back, but to get off of that, this, these are just so cool. Nothing on the bottom, but, um, Great pickup for whoever got this. Great, great price, too. So these things are awesome. Great, great, great purchase for whoever got this. And yeah, I think that's about all I got. At least for today. Um, I will be bringing back the feature, 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 items, items, items of the week. But I will do it in separate videos on their own. So it can be like kind of little, little shorts. It'd be quick minute or two video to watch and it's i feel like it's better that way instead of adding it on the end of these just to make these longer um but yeah good times fun fun yay look at that i got a crooked pinky that's about as that's as straight as i can make it what the broke it when i was a kid and that it just, it just looks weird, don't it? I know I'm not the only one. If you got a pinky like this, let me know. And tell me the struggles you've had, because I've tried to get it straightened out, and they said they'd have to snip, snip that in there, and then, like, it would be straight, but I would never be able to, like, move it or bend it and stuff. I'm like, why would I get a finger fixed just to have a floppy thing just go flopping around? But um, I'm getting sidetracked. 
Thank you very much for watching my video, spending time with me, getting to see cool things going on in my store. I really, really appreciate it. And I hope you guys come back for more. And if you could, click that subscribe button. Cost costs you nothing to do. And it just shows that you're supporting what I do and just gives me more motivation to keep doing it. I'm not going to ask you to comment if you don't want to. That's <laughs> It helps algorithms for people. I, it doesn't matter to me. You can just hit subscribe, hit the like button. I just know that you guys are appreciating what, what you're watching. And I'll continue doing what I'm doing regardless. So <laughs> thank you so much. I appreciate it. And God bless.